15 first alert weather forecast. Well, certainly some gorgeous weather across the area for today. Yes, a bit windier than it was yesterday, but really didn't offset uh, how nice it has been out there. Clear blue skies and uh, again, just some warm conditions. Temperatures actually made it up close to 60 this afternoon and they're not going to drop off too quickly here. Uh, while we continue to have the daylight for another hour or so, we'll be in the 50s, still some time to enjoy the nice weather this evening. And then as uh, we do head into the hours after dark, we'll be dropping down into the 40s, but it's not going to get all that cold tonight because we're going to keep those breezy winds going from the east and southeast. A live look at our Nicolay Bank Hastings Way Skycam showing all the sunshine and again, those rather brisk winds sustained at about 20 miles per hour from the southeast. We're sitting at 57 degrees, but the air is very dry. Look at that dew point right now, just in the 20s. If we had calm winds tonight with the mostly clear sky, uh, it would get a lot colder than what I'm forecasting for tonight. Satellite and radar across the upper Midwest, the Great Lakes, well, you don't see anything. That's how clear it is locally, but we head over to the west by a state or two, and then all of a sudden we run into not only clouds, but a couple of bands of rain, even some embedded thunderstorms here. This is all part of our next storm system, which has been really coming together in uh, western Nebraska this afternoon. That is going to make its way towards the east and then over the area as we head on into Monday. So that means at least a couple days of rain chances, and we'll likely see that work in by later tomorrow. Eastern parts of Wisconsin, cooler, mostly in the low and mid 50s today, even chilly along the lakeshore there with a bit more of an onshore flow. Meanwhile, we have had the, mi the milder temperatures this afternoon, as again, some towns have hit 60 this afternoon. Still pretty warm as we head through the Dakotas down into Nebraska. There's our low center where you kind of see these different colors coming together to the west. That is where it's colder and to the east and south, it is warmer. So tomorrow is going to be really uh, reflect or impacted by cloud cover and the arrival of rain. So tonight we're going to be dropping down into the 30s. That's about as cool as we'll get with the breezes. And then for tomorrow, well, temperatures will be limited uh, for the warm up during the morning until the rain starts to come in. And then temperatures probably will cool a bit into the afternoon because of those dry conditions. So it will be a chilly rain as we head into tomorrow afternoon. And then once this band lifts north into Monday, well, we'll tap into some milder weather. Speaking of Monday, well, locally, of course, we're going to be seeing the partial solar eclipse. The question is, will we see it? And unfortunately, odds are not great for us. Uh, we'll sit there to see the uh, partial eclipse begin at 1251. Cloudy skies maximum, which is about 80% or 81% coverage, will be at 204. There is a chance there could be a few breaks in the clouds for the afternoon, and then it does pull away, and uh, it's done by about 317. So not totally uh, out of hope here, but certainly the farther south you are, the better chances skies will be clear. There's our storm system out towards the west, and as we track our forecast model into the overnight, clouds increase by morning, and here's that band of rain uh, as we go on into the late morning and the afternoon. So we're likely to deal with the rain tomorrow, Tomorrow night, chance of showers on Monday, especially in the morning. There could be a lingering shower on Tuesday. Uh, much of the rest of the week should be mostly dry, a slight chance of a shower Thursday. And temperatures will actually be a little bit above average after being so cool for many weeks in a row there. So actually uh, feeling uh, finally like uh, April. I know, I'm loving this, an exciting week ahead. I feel like you can't complain about any of the rain we get if and we get hopefully that. we'll get the rain out of the way and yeah. we'll have at least a couple of days to Back enjoy. Back some sunshine again. I yeah. love it. Awesome. <laughs> Thanks so much, Darren. Yes. <laughs>